guys and welcome to Bubble Pop Kids. So if you love jewelry and you love crazy art sets, we are in luck. We have the Crazy Jewels Gem Creations Ultimate Gem Machine. If you look on the box, it's got a picture of this amazing machine that's going to make bracelets, rings, necklaces, everything. And the way we're going to do it is set and press. Well, I cannot wait to open this box up and start making some jewelry. Okay, so let's so I do just it. dump the box out onto the table and look at all this stuff. I've never seen so many little pieces and accessories. I'm getting so excited. the most important part to this jewelry kit is the gem machine. Here it is. It looks so cute. It's got little fake gems there. And I'm not sure what these two pieces are. We're gonna find out. I think they fit in here some way, maybe like that. And Next, we get down. tons of gem strips. Now let me give you a close-up of these. These are strips and they have all the gems in there that will come pressed out in the machine. There's like this regular diamond color, there's pink gems, purple, yellow, green, all of the, ooh, they even have orange, so cool. So we have so many of those. There are some more of these accessories here. These are all the little pieces to put the gems inside. So many different things so to make. So now that we have all the accessories we need and we took a close look, let's get started. So first, I think we can make this really cool bracelet. It looks kind of like a watch bracelet and I'm gonna put three different charms on there. And as you see, the charms are really, really dull. They don't have any shine. But I have these gem strips here. There's some green blue, pink, and purple. And we are gonna dazzle them up with this machine. Let's show you how to work this machine. Okay, so here it is. You're gonna open it up, and there's a strip there. And as you see, this fits in there perfectly. So the area where the color is, you're gonna flip until you see the silver side. And you're just gonna slide it through and stop right where that dot is. You're gonna stop it right there. So it's lined up. And then at the bottom, there's this piece here. You're gonna put it in, and as you notice, there's a little circle here. So I'm gonna take, we can start with the heart. Here is the heart charm. And if you notice, there's little circles on there. I'm gonna put one of the circles and line it right into that pin that is sitting on this blue piece here. Now I'm gonna press down and make sure it's all lined up and click and hopefully we have one of those gems <gasps> and look how cool that is you guys here it is so one of the gems came right onto this heart here just by pressing down on the machine and if you notice when I take this piece out I'll slide it out like that ah okay there we go one is missing so there it is it went right into there we have so many different ones we're gonna pop them out of there and finish up this bracelet. So I think we can make the rest of this heart purple. So I'm just gonna put these purple gems, load them back into the machine, and line that pin up with the next one, which is right here. Now I'm gonna take this, put the next hole, put it right on top of the pin, just like that, and press. Oop. Let's check on our heart and see if it's completed. And it is, it's got seven of the purple stones on there. It looks so pretty. So what do you see? We do this oval and the star for this pink bracelet. Okay, so for the star, I think I'm gonna do that one green. It would look really pretty like that. So I'm gonna take the purple gems out and I'm gonna get this pretty, it's like a lime green and load the machine and line the pin up right there. Okay, perfect. Now I'm going to get the star and line it up right on the pin, just like that. Press down, and our first one is in. Look how simple that was. 
that we have five more of those green ones to put in. Let's do it. Load the machine. You have to move this here. Just like that. Press. Ooh, and it came really quickly. The more you do this, the quicker you get the hang of it and it goes really smooth. Let's check on our star. I think we finished it. That was really quick. And here it is with those cute green gems. So now we have two. The last one is this oval shape. And I think we can make this with, uh, let's go with pink. So okay. now that all three of our gems are completed, I'm going to string them on the bracelet. First, I can start with this star. And then the heart. And this cute pink little oval here. And there we go. Our first piece of jewelry is completed. And just close it up to see what it will look like. That is so, so, so super cute. This bracelet is super cute and was so quick to make, but it looks like it took a long time. It really didn't. So let's make so another piece of jewelry. For our next piece of jewelry, I think we can make a charm bracelet. I have four charms here. This one is really cute. It says love, and we can put the little gem right in the O. We have a moon. This cute little flower and a cute little cloud with the LOL. We're gonna make the O the diamond or whatever gem we're gonna put. And we have these four little hooks to string them on the bracelet, so let's get started. Let's load the machine. I think we'll start with the love charm. So I'm gonna make the little O inside of that purple. I think that would look really cute. Just gonna put that right on there and press down. And here it is. So that's our O. Now for this moon here, I think a blue would look really pretty. We haven't used blue yet, so here is the blue. I'm gonna load it in. Ooh, got a little jam there, okay. Put this right on here. Press down. And easy as our right. cute little LOL cloud here. I'm gonna take this out and I think we can use a diamond. That would be really pretty. So I have the diamonds here. Put that into the machine. Put that right there. And press. There it is. Ooh, sparkly. And I think a light pink would be good for the flower here. Put the little flowy, press down, and there Let's we go. Let's take a close up look at those four charms. And now we're gonna string them on the bracelet. We have these little hooks here. Just gonna open them. These are kind of small to work with. Here's the LOL. Put it right on like that. I'm gonna put that at the end of the bracelet here. I'm just gonna string it through one of these chain links right there. Close it. And that is so cute. There is the first charm on our gem charm.
far it's got four of them, but there's a huge space in the middle that I think we can put another. So there's this cute little four leaf clover. I think we can make a green gem and put it right there. Here's the green. Here is the clover. It's gonna go right in the middle. Press and done. That was so quick. There is our charm bracelet finish, looking super, super beautiful. I love it so much. I never thought that I'd be able to make something like this, but this machine made it really easy. And here is what it looks like on my arm, and it looks even better. So cute. So how about a necklace to go with that bracelet? So here is a long string to make a chain. And we'll put this big one in the middle. We can put the butterfly and the dragonfly on the sides and this really cute lock and key. And here's the first one and we're gonna keep going around. So as you see here, there's some green, there's some diamonds, I'm going to put a couple more diamonds and then maybe some pink and purples. And our pretty center, it looks kind of like a flower or a zigzag. I'm not sure what it is, it's really pretty. That is the center of our necklace, so let's make the rest of the charms. For this cute dragonfly, I'm gonna go with this pretty orange color. I think that would look really cool. And just put that right in the center. Click down. Here is the pretty dragonfly with the orange. For the cute key, I think we can go with a plain diamond. Put it in. Okay, right there. Click. And there it is. We can go with this yellowish goldish color for the lock. Just put that right there. Here is the cute lock. And I think the butterfly would look really pretty with blue, so let's put blue. We're going to do two gemstones in there. Here's the first. And the second. Here are those cute charms. We have the key, the lock, the big one for the center, and these two. Now let's string them on the necklace. Here is the final necklace, and look how pretty it looks. It's got that big gem there, it's got the butterfly, the dragonfly, and then these two up here. So cute. So for our last piece of jewelry, I see this cute little band here, and I'm thinking to put this on there. There are five different settings we can put. I'm going to put a large one in the middle and two smaller gems on the sides. And that is finished. We have some orange, pink, and blue. Just gonna open this up. Put it through there. And another one. 
After looking at this, this looks a little dull. So I see all of these cute little square settings. So I think I'm gonna fill these up and add them to the bracelet. I think we have enough of these. I'm just gonna open this up and string them on. I have to take this off again. Here is how the bracelet looks now. It looks so much cuter with those on the sides. It was really plain Here's with another just look this. at all the jewelry we made today. And this machine makes a lot more amazing earrings, rings, hair pieces, everything. But we just had time for a few today. So we have this bracelet, this one here. We have the charm bracelet and the necklace. These are super cute. Okay guys, so that is the end of this Crazy Art Ultimate Gem Machine video. This was such a cool craft and I was so surprised how easy it was. We're gonna have so many more different jewelry sets coming on, Disney Princess, Shopkins, you name it, we're Bubble Pop Kids, and you can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day, bye!